so guys, we are still in La Paz and I'm on the Mampongokai Avenue. I just saw someone selling fried yam here. It's actually Naomi's kitchen. He's cutting them into nine sizes. Okay. 20 pesos. It's 20 pesos for one. So you can just take a look at it. She's frying the yam and she's using the spatula to collect some of the yams from the packet. The hot oil. Wow. You can see how the oil is just boiling. Naomi's kitchen, she has potatoes and yam with gizzard, with sausage, with chicken wings and chicken thighs. She also has spanla. So if you want to eat here, you can see that there are some bowls, there are some plates here, which she used to serve her customers and they normally sit around this side to eat. She has tissues, she has paper towels in case you need them. And if you want to take it away, she has her poly bags here, which she uses to sell her fried yam and fried potatoes. And the potatoes so five. And me pay, me pay, me pay hot one. I want the hot yam. I just saw that she took some of them from the fire, and that's what I want. So she's taking the yam for me, the fried yam for me. You can see how golden brown it is. It looks so awesome. It's so incredible, guys. Very hot. She just took it from the hot boiling oil. I also want some potatoes. Yes, sweet potatoes, guys. Okay, mommy gives that so wants to be. And I saw said no back on. And also yes, eh? Okay. And I wings no so yes, eh? Okay, so we can see chicken wings here and then I can see chicken thigh. But you want me chicken wings in the back? Uh -huh. One of the first of this fish, which is the panla. That's the panla, guys. Okay, so she serves the yam with a green sauce, red pepper, and then black sauce. So whichever one you want, she's going to give it to you. It's maple red nini black. Huh. Red pepper, you can see she's giving me red pepper. And the black sauce. She also has onions, okay, so she's adding some onions to it for me. Yes, and then the black sauce goes right in there. Hey guys, this looks so incredible. This is so amazing. Wow. Place for anyone who wants to eat here. And this is where you sit once you come to eat here. Okay. Guys, you are all invited to my fried yam and fried potatoes with my gizzard, my sausage, my chicken wing and my fish take a look at this guys the red sauce it looks so attractive it's naomi's kitchen guys everything i have here costs nine ghana cities nine ghana cities which is less than two dollars yes it's less than two dollars so in ghana you can get an afternoon meal for less than two dollars take a look at it guys you are all invited Come along and let's eat this together. Okay, so first of all, I'm going for my yam. Wow, so easy to break. It just broke out just like that, like Titanic. Wow. Mm. The yam is so crunchy and very soft. It's very warm. So, I'm taking the salt is balanced, the spices in it. It's really made it very nice. Hmm. There's also sausage in here. Wow. It's very spongy. You can see how juicy the sausage is. Well cooked, well fried. This is fried sausage for you guys.
Mm. Very juicy. Mm. There's also chicken wings. This chicken is very... <laughs> I wonder how old the chicken was when it was killed. <laughs> mm. Tasting my food. And I recommend Naomi to you guys, guys. Anytime you want to take fried fish, fried yam with fried potatoes, it's Naomi's Kitchen in La Paz on the Mampo Okain Avenue. Anytime, any day, she's around. Yes, so on a scale of one to 10, I'll give Naomi nine, because the yam is perfect, it's awesome. It was very hot when I started eating it, and that's what I want. The potatoes, well cooked, very golden brown in color. The fish, the gizzard, the chicken, the, everything, the sausage, the sauce, everything was incredibly nice. Guys, I recommend Naomi's kitchen. She's here all the time. Just come, grab your yam, grab your potatoes, grab anything you want. So it's Naomi for you. See you guys in the next video. Guys, we are still in La Paz and we are reviewing food, street food. Yes, so we are still on the La Paz street. And we are here in front of Abochi's Kebab. <laughs> he literally doesn't have a name here, but I've given him a name because I can see some kebab here. Okay. So Abochi, good afternoon. This is our home and liver. Okay, so sausage, uh, gizzard, liver, yeah. any, anything, goat yeah, meat, a point in them. Oh, okay. It's the air saying, what one is saying? Bakubia three Bakubia three cities. Yeah. Wow. So everything here goes for three cities yeah. for each. That's quite good. Okay, it's a bochi, my ebia baku baku. My ebia baku baku. The goat meat, the gizzard, and then the liver for us. But the sausage looks not cooked, so it's actually cooked. It. Okay, it's all slightly um, sausage. You know, wow, well, I said that they um, green pepper, any onions, the same. Oh, okay, so if you don't want the sliced one with the onions, he was going to give you a full one. It's a busy street, you can buy clothes here, right in front of Abochi. Okay, so he's back. Okay, this is the full one. Okay. Wow. I think I'm going to request that he puts that one in the stick for me as well. So I'll be able to, you know, hold it and handle it. Very well. So our gizzard, our sausage, our goat meat, and our liver is on the grill. And he's grilling it for us. Okay, so you can see that he's cutting the sausage through so that the heat can penetrate very well to cook the sausage well for us. Let's be properly cooked for us. So the smoke is literally going to penetrate every part of the, the sausage once he's doing the story. Okay, so about here, I can see some bones here. Uh, uh, goat bones. Yeah. Smain, the sausage with some oil. Is it only oil? Uh, oil? Oil, okay. So you can see that it's literally bringing out, causing the smoke to come out very well. So it's going to suck into the sausage. And guys, I think we're going to love this. But liver, I'm cooking liver before. So you... Okay. Meat. Okay, so he's saying that he has cooked uh, the, the gizzard, the liver, and the goat's uh, meat. So it's cooked already. Yeah. So it's actually smeared it with some. Uh, is it pepper? The to. kebab pepper. Okay, so let's take a look at Abuchi's pepper. Oh, guys. Yes. So this is the pepper. Yeah. This Abuchi is coming out of the sausage. So he's, he's, he's applying some you know, kebab pepper to our sausage. 
now and it's going back on the grill wow wow the smoke is kind of too much okay okay so guys it's applying some of the pepper on the sausage and this is actually not the ordinary pepper you see on the market the ordinary powder pepper you see on the market this is specially made for kebab for sausage for um, gizzard for goat meat and for the liver it's specially made for it yes so you can really yeah it's really burning out the pepper is really burning out and it's penetrating into our sausage wow you can see how the color is changing the color this is changing the smoke that is coming out of the sausage wow and there is this oil you know because it's goat meat you can see some oil coming out of it it's just melting the oil from the meat wow oh, this is so good so the vegetables are also being par cooked par cooked not really cooked so the juice is on there so for me this is so for me our sausage gizzard goat meat and liver is ready you can see how juicy they look yes so our goatee has served us in the plate and he's adding some of the kebab pepper wow wow thank you so about how much does everything cost everything is 15 students guys Everything I have here is 15 cities. So we are going to start the best part of the show. Okay. So guys, we're starting with the sausage. Yes. So we're tasting. <laughs> wow it's really hot because we took it from the grill it's just ready and then we enter this yeah so this is the sausage